Hey guys, it's Emily with Cozy Clicks, and today I want to show you how you can use layers and masks to create symmetry in your photo in Photoshop. Now, this tutorial is actually brought to you by my friend and great photographer, Joey Buckley with SNJ Photography. She is part of a brand new feature I'm rolling out on the Cozy Clicks blog and YouTube channel called Editing Tip Tuesday. If you would like to learn how to be a part of this and submit your favorite editing tip, you can by going to the link below or checking out CozyClicks.com forward slash Joey. Let's get started with this tutorial so you can learn how to use layers to create symmetry. So the first thing we're going to do is I pulled up my image that I want to work with and I'm seeing that the left side is kind of blank and there's too much white here. I'd like it to look more like the right side. I would like more of this green and yellow to be popping up over here. So this is a perfect tutorial for this particular image. So the first thing I want to do is I want to go up to layer and duplicate my background layer. You'll see that pops up in my layer panel here. Now, I want the colors that are on the right side over on the left side. So we're going to invert this duplicate layer. I'm gonna to go to Edit, Transform, and then flip horizontal. That inverts the layer. However, I don't want all of this showing, so we're going to hide it. I'm gonna create a layer mask by clicking right down here and then I'm going to invert that layer mask by pushing Control or Command I. That hides that layer. The mask here will allow us to paint on just the areas that we want to pop through. So I'm going to grab my brush and make sure it's set to white. And I'm going to brush on this layer mask the areas I want to pop through. So you can see I'm getting those yellow flowers coming through in the background and some more of this green. Now, I could really take my time and adjust the brush and get really close to him. And down by his shirt. I'm going to go a little quicker today just to save time. I do notice that I got some of his hair that popped through here. If that happens on yours, an easy fix, you just change your brush back to black and you brush over the areas that you don't want showing through. That's pretty easy. And that's a great way to add symmetry to your photo. Now you can see I can turn this off and there was my original and back on again. I've got this beautiful yellow and green all through the back of my image. Now, if you want to see this written tutorial and you want to check out some more of Joey Buckley's fantastic photography. You can do that by clicking the link at the bottom or going to CozyClicks.com forward slash Joey. You can also learn how to be a part of Editing Tip Tuesday. Now, I always appreciate your likes and comments on my videos and I would love if you would subscribe to the channel where I will be adding tutorials all the time. Also, if you do try this tutorial or any of my YouTube tutorials, I'd love to see how it looks on your photos. So if you post one over on Instagram, mention or tag me too, at CozyClicks. I'd love to see your results. Thanks again for watching. See you next time.